it's Kat. Welcome back to the channel, guys. So today we're going to be talking about one of my favorite features of Wizard City. So right behind me, we have a nice team up. So it just says join a team above it, but it's a kiosk. Can we go up to it? We're able to join teams for the different worlds we've already completed. And for skeleton keys and dungeons. So we're able to click through the different worlds. Um, sometimes there's not as many. It just depends what time of the day you get on. So we have Mount Olympus. We have Croctopia. So th some of these are longer and they'll have the dungeons. So this is a great way to get through the dungeons if you haven't completed them or you want to farm them. But let's go ahead and pick out an easy one to join. We'll join this one since it's about to start. So you just click it. And once it's ready, it will teleport you into the room. This one is a longer instance since it is a technically a dungeon. So this is one way you can team up and meet people while playing the game or just do quests yourself if you're working towards completing one or two of them that you're having some trouble with. You can also start the team ups and other people can join through those kiosks. They're great to utilize, especially if you don't see a dungeon that you want to do up there. You can always just start your own and wait maybe a minute or two and one or more people should join as you can get up to a maximum of four people at once in it to help with the dungeon. Um, some of them it does make it a lot easier having more people. Other ones like this one it can be harder especially if you have to uh, solve puzzles. So like this one is a boss battle so I'm just jumping in to help out. There was a few other people but they don't seem to be over here anymore so I'm just gonna kill him without them because they didn't come with for some reason. So the only important thing when doing the team ups if you join the battle, you have to make sure you join and you kill the enemy while the person who created the battle is in it. Otherwise, I won't give you any uh, points for it. So another important thing to remember about doing any kind of dungeon or just team up is that you do get a small like penalty for leaving prior to them finishing the dungeon. So normally it will say you can't join another team up until this one gets completed or it will say like a certain um, time frame before you can join another one. So it's best that if you pick it, you have enough time to do it or you're willing to commit as long as the um, host of it is there. So the most important part to remember also if you're helping out with dungeons is to make sure that you get all the way through the end. So this one we have to go back and talk to Professor Winthrop. So it's technically not done until we finish talking to him. So I can't quite pour it out yet. Alright and that's the end of the dungeon right there. Now it shows back my main quest line. So we'll go back to whatever your defaulted quest is. So we can just go ahead and hit this since it shows exit. It'll take us back to the kiosk. So one of the reasons to do the team ups here is you can actually start working towards an achievement. So there's different ones for however many teams you've helped. So there's team player. Then the next one for teams helped, you need to have 500. And then after that is a 1000 teams help one. So that's useful for going over here to talk to Derek Blaze. Now if we go to his equipment shop, we can look in here and he has a sand swarm permanent mount. So this only costs 7,500 gold if you get the team manager. So that's from helping about a thousand teams. So it's not terrible if you're farming a boss anyways for holiday items. You're going to be working towards it and already have probably half of it. You can also get the Blaze Fox pet, which is really cute. Look at his little tail wiggle. So that one's from Team Leader as well, and it gives uh, the balance blade. All right. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe down below. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye.